Hi there, my name is David Netherland. I'm with Roadside Beggars Music, and today in the studio we have Matthew Bell and Next of Kin. Guys, thank you for joining us today. Mm -hmm. uh, why don't you tell us about yourselves a little bit? Where are y'all from? So we're actually from the Dallas area. Um, I think all of us are in in North Dallas. Uh, we all kind of grew up in this, the DFW Metroplex, and uh, we've been playing together about uh, officially about three years. Um, okay. As the three of us, mm -hmm. but you know, I've I've played with either one of these guys for any number of years oh, before yeah. the three of us came together. So, mm -hmm. so did y'all play separately before y'all met each other at various locations? Yeah. We did. Yeah, I started the violin back when I was in elementary school and and carried it all the way through junior high, high school, and college. So I had been classically trained on the violin. So I played long before um, I even uh, met Matt and oh, put it down cool. for a while after after college and then picked it back up um, when this all kind of came together by happenstance. <laughs> Great. Look forward yeah. to hearing that in the video. Yeah. Yeah. What about you, Dan? Uh, yeah, I... Um, have, I've been playing drums for like most of my life, okay. so yeah. With what we do here, it's totally different, which is why I like it. It's yeah. fun changing it up, but yeah, I'm just kind of a drummer that has sort of migrated into some other, I don't know, uncharted territory. And you see a lot of musicians do that, so I mean, yeah. it's pretty cool to be able to have uh, that diversity. Yeah, what, yeah. what about you, Matt? Well, I've been um, kind of doing music my entire life, um, I guess, uh, but uh, really only recently. I'm uh, I'm really a vocalist by, by trade, but uh, kind of picked up the guitar just out of necessity, I suppose. And uh, so I've been doing this, I guess, probably about 10 years or so. Uh, but uh, yeah, that's that's kind of kind of it. So, oh, great. Yeah. Musical inspirations. Where do y'all get kind of your inspiration from, your favorite artists? Why don't you start? Well, okay. <laughs> well, I love, you know, Bob Marley, anything from that to James Brown to, mm. to Miles Davis. I mean, it's just... I, a little bit I, of funk, reggae, oh, jazz. Reggae, yeah, anything? jazz, okay. a lot of all kinds of stuff. Yeah. But, I mean, we're, you know, obviously we're kind of in, in the folk vein. Right. So, I mean, we also love, you know, some modern, you know, like Mumford and & Sons and oh, the Lumineers and like that yeah. kind of stuff, you yeah. know. Well, I'm sure so. that probably uh, influences the music that y'all play right now, too. Definitely. Very yeah. cool. Yeah. Well, what about you, Darren? You said you were classically on, trained. Yeah, so. but I grew up on soul as well. So, you, you know, Stevie Wonder yeah. and, you know, the pop rock, Elton John. Mm -hmm. Um, and I, I'm a huge smooth jazz fan, so I like, you know, Huge Groove and Peter White. And right on. I'm on the softer side of Sears, so. Yeah, <laughs> we have some differences so there. Yeah. He's yeah. on the smooth side. He's I'm a, on the, he's on the, the more mild, traditional. More traditional. Miles yeah. Davis side. There's yeah. still jazz though, right? <laughs> yeah. 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 I'm on the what about you, Matt? Uh, you know, I mean, I grew up on classic rock, um, but uh, I just always loved, like, the great songwriters, or the people that I consider great songwriters. Um, like, the first concert I ever went to was... Billy Joel and Elton John Good when I was deal. when I was nine years old. Right, so right. I imagine that had quite the impression on me. <laughs> uh, but uh, yeah, I just I mean, kind of anything and everything. All the stuff that they've mentioned, uh, I literally listened to all of it. Um, but uh, I think it's it's we definitely have kind of that folk instrumentation, but we kind of play soulful tunes with it. Right. Uh, and we write kind of. Uh, I don't know, singer, songwriter, lyricism, I guess. I don't know mm -hmm. a better way to describe that. So. No, that's great. great. What What is y'all's uh, next big project or uh, collaboration coming up right now, or next album or something? So right now, we uh, we actually just finished recording some songs uh, in the studio, and we are, we're hoping to release those here pretty soon. Um, not really sure when that's uh, going to be coming out, but uh, be on the lookout for it. We'll, uh, we've got a, just some new songs, and some of those that we got to play, uh, right. Here today, and uh, so that's that's some of the stuff that we're working on right now. Well, where can the uh, the, the viewers go to find y'all? Where can we go online to you know see Matthew Bell and the Next of Kin? Uh, you can go to Facebook, uh, Matthew Bell and the Next of Kin. Uh, we've definitely got our Facebook page out there. Uh, you know, you can follow us on social media, any and all of it. Uh, and then we also have a website. Uh, it's mbnok.com. So, mbnok.com. All right. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah. Good, good. You want to explain where we got the name Matthew yeah. Bell in the next year? Oh, yeah, yeah. that's, that's, great, uh, that's great a good question, story. For sure. So, uh, it turns out that uh, both of these guys here are my brothers in law. All uh, right. So, uh, he, uh, Jared is my wife's brother, mm -hmm. and Darren is my sister's husband. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, yeah. She's yeah, prettier than him, so. Yeah. Yeah. I, I would hope so. Says you. <laughs> Get that on camera. Most, there you go. <laughs> good deal. Well, guys, thank you for joining us today. Uh, I hope you all enjoy the. 
The music they're going to play for, I heard it earlier this morning, and it's fantastic. So please enjoy. Yeah. 